Hey guys, Nick here. Just wanted to give you a quick update on my Uber Scoot and some of the things that I learned along the way. Um, first, I want to give a shout out to the guy that apparently liked my vice. It's a good vice. A lot of projects get done on it. Um, okay, back to the Uber Scoot. Um, put a pair of pocket bike tires on the back. Ended up getting a new motor, but you wouldn't be able to tell it by looking at it. Um, it's just, the exhaust is the same. Everything else is pretty much the same. Um, I want to share with you guys a few things that I learned along the way. Um, first off, this is the shroud that came off that motor. So if you're on eBay and you see one with this kind of shroud... It's pretty much the same motor, except there's a few things that are different, and I'll show you them here in a second. Okay, I'm back. Um, here are some of the differences that I learned right off the bat. Um, I modified this head, and if you guys want to see what I've done, please look through all my videos um, of all the progress that I've made. Um, first off, this is why I got a new motor. Um, that ended up breaking off, and it sounded awful. Um, I was so embarrassed, I ended up walking it halfway home. Um, these are some of the differences. The Uber Scoot head is not a 44 millimeter piston. It's not. And I'll show you. It mics out at 42.8. Where this one is exactly what I have on my new motor. Um, I suggest you guys, if you're having any problems with your stock motor, upgrade it. Um, found out that like the screws aren't stripping out as often. Just not having as many problems. And right off the bat the rev limit isn't on this motor um you could just end up finding parts a lot better and a lot cheaper and um there's a lot of competition on ebay so people will end up working with you um this one ends up zero it back out sorry this is kind of hard to do on camera We'll call it 44 millimeters, 43.9 millimeters. So this is a little bit bigger. Um, yeah, the transfer ports look different, but it's going to all work the same. I'm going to end up porting this out. Um, I'm going to get in the transfers, get, it, uh, get inside the exhaust, and just take my time on it while I run my scooter how it is and actually the stock motor runs a little bit better than this motor did even after all my modifications did I'm sorry to say that because I'm pretty proud of my port work um, but like I said these are easier to come by you, you, you can get them cheaper um, you don't, it's, it's like the stock aluminum on the Uber Scoot is cheap, and I was having a little bit of problems, so I just, I just went with a different motor, and these kind of transfers, and, and, um, back to those tires, if I didn't say it already, I gained four maybe five miles an hour by swapping out those tires um if you guys want to see all the, all the modifications that i did um please skip back through my other videos um they're not too detailed because i'm not i'm not that good of a camera guy or whatever but um check those out let me know what you think please don't be too hard on me um, and yeah.
Check those out and let me know what you think. Thanks.